Hey everybody, welcome back to your favorite 420 podcast. You already know who this is, your main host, Gino. Hopefully everybody's having a good ass day today. It is very nice outside here in Chicago. Um, I know we still inside, but you know what? It's very nice outside. I sure recommend you guys be smoking outside or, you know, just having a fun time outside doing your thing. You know, do what you gotta do. Today's episode, I am giving you guys another product review. Uh, where it actually it's going to be very different than usual uh, and very unique. By the way, the boy Ozzy is right here. He's today. Um, so you'll be pretty much seeing the boy Ozzy folks right here during the vlog. Let's get back to today's video. So like I said, we got Jane's and Mary's right here. We got four different flavors. I am very excited to try them out for the first time i've been very very tempted to try them i just haven't been trying them you know because i wanted to give you guys my first initial reaction and thoughts because it is infused ice cream y'all like this shit has thc in it which is very very cool and i am very honored to be doing this review um as well the ceo jason he slided through can of vibe so Please, please, please don't snooze on that episode. Great episode of Smoke too. And yeah, so let's get started. So you know what? I got my puff coat here ready for action. And we're just gonna take one bad brewery before we start today's review. Cheers, you guys. That was a good dab. My pop cool wasn't working for a little bit, but then I had my rig and shh, you haven't taken hits in the rig for a minute. And you've been just doing your puff core or card or whatever e rig you have. Shit dangerous, y'all. Should be hurting my lungs, but I'll be getting high as fuck. So I put all of them right now in freezer. Um, so it just won't melt. But I'm gonna just take them one at a time. Go with our first one, and it's the Jane's and Mary's Cookies and Cream. So, of course, like an Oreo, you know, the Oreo flavor. Um, that's that's how I really think of it. You know, the Cookies and Cream is just a Oreo flavor for me. But the total milligrams it has 75, and it's just THC. Um, look at that right there. Just you guys. Look at that. Yeah, right? Look at that design. It's pretty cool, right? I like the design, the color, you know, like, it's very colorful. I could say, like, it just stands out by the color. Um, I like how the design it is, you know, the detailed of the ice cream and the weed leaf. Um, of course, since it's cookies and cream, it has the, the cookie right here. Um, but yeah, so again, one more time for the design in general. I like it. I, I think it's a cool design. I like how it has the little, you know, the cone and the two scoops with, I guess it's people's faces laughing, of course, you know, just having a good time. Um, so yeah, so we opened it and like, that's how it looks, the cookies and cream. Like normal ice cream, you know, you know, to it, not special, you know, but you know, what is special about it is the effects, you feel me? So, you know what? Get a scoop, good scoop. There you go, good scoop. You wish you had ice cream too, right? Yeah. <laughs> but it has chocolate and weed. So we don't know how that's gonna go. I'm very surprised that, you know, my boy Ozzy here is just chilling with us today. He's usually just on his own shit. No type of weed taste of, at all. Like you don't, you can't even 
tell if it's, you know, if it has even weed or if it's even infused, you know? Like, it tastes fucking good. Like, this is Oreo. Like, this is, like, if you go to, like, Jewel or even if you go, like, to, you know, like, Dunk, like, Baskin Robbins, you feel me? Like, if you just eat a normal cookies and cream ice cream, you feel me? Just the fact that every scoop is, like, a little closer to your high, you know? Like, it's just... Love it. <laughs> I slow myself before I finish it up. But that was very good. Yeah, that was the cookies and cream. And personally, I love Oreos. This was this is why I kind of went with this first because it's my favorite flavor, and I like it. We're gonna move on to the next flavor. We're on to the second flavor of the day, and it is called strawberry cream. Go strawberry cream, and it's the same design for all. Like you can say, all of the little you know containers. So it's just a difference of you know flavor, and of course, you can see strawberry right there, and as well right there. I like how it looks. You know, with the strawberry and the weed leaf. It looks very nice. I like it. So let's open it. You know, and there you go, you know, like the pink color of the strawberry and, you know, it's just, it's just like, again, it's just ice cream, you know, like, it looks like it's normal ice cream. And one thing, you know, that I forgot to do on the cookies and cream is did not smell it, but let me smell it, you know. No, there's no really smell to it. <laughs> and again, it's just ice cream, y'all. Yeah. I would, you know. Just, but again, you never know, you never know. So I'm just doing it, y'all. I'm just doing it, you know. Just gotta make sure everything's off the checklist. So that's the first scoop of the strawberry cream. <laughs> hmm. It's good strawberry ice cream, actually. So here's one thing from guys. <clears throat> I don't know if it's me or not, but I've gotten strawberry ice cream where it really doesn't taste sweet. And I don't know, sometimes it doesn't have no I don't know, it just doesn't taste good at all. It tastes like medicine. I'm not sure if that's just me. <laughs> but if you guys know what I mean, then you know what I mean. In general, this is just good ice cream. It's sweet. It's ice cream. And it gets you high. And this one, again, has 75 milligrams of THC. And as you can see, let me just put it closer. It has Delta 9. Not no Delta 8. Delta 9. So this is our third flavor of the day. Um, and this is like our last ice cream that has... Um, like, it's like dairy, you feel me? Like, because the other one, the last one, our fourth one, is like sh shorbert or shorbet. Something like that. One of those two words. Sorry, you guys. Um, but yeah, so this is what's called peanut butter fudge. And as you can see, it just has like the like pieces of like chocolate. It gives me like the little chocolate that has peanut butter, like a little Reese's probably. You know, just, just by the, the picture of it. And it looks like it's, it looks like it's chocolate, you know, like chocolate ice cream. Uh, but, okay, we'll see. <clears throat> so far, based on the two flavors, you know, the strawberry and the cookies and cream, they've been good, like, this is very good, you know, like, wow. I mean, I'm not just saying that because I'm reviewing it or just because it has weed in it, but like, if it didn't have weed in it, you know. That, that's, that could be, you know, a whole different story. But, like, if it didn't have weed in it, then this should still be out in store. See, with this one, it reminds me of those ice cream, chocolate ice cream that, that came in the trucks when we were kids. You know what I mean? But with a little kick with peanut butter of it in it. That's it. Overall, the, this, this peanut butter fudge is, is good. 
Um, again, it has the kick of the peanut butter in it, for sure. I'm not big on it. I know our boy Ozzy would fuck with it because, you know, he's a big peanut butter guy. But again, it has sweet in it, my guy, and chocolate. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so <clears throat> that was it. That was uh, the scoops. And now we're actually going to give you something for you guys. We're going to make a cone of the three flavors. That's freaking dope, right? <laughs> the cookies and cream, the strawberry, and the fudge. All in one, guys. So we're going to see how this goes. All right, and I'm ready because, you know, I got my ice cream scoop. Damn, they're very small. I would have thought it would be better. It doesn't look like I would need the ice cream scoop at all. Okay, that's the fudge. Oh. Okay, so that's the fudge. With the with the strawberry ice cream right here. I'm just doing like half a scoop, guy, because look at the cone. Look at this. Oh, right there, yeah. <laughs> My deformed cone. I'm sorry. I thought this was going to be like a normal size cone or something. I guess not. And lastly, the cookies and cream. Hey, guys. So with the amount of scoops, you know, by itself, I had, and now with this, I know it doesn't look so good. Just, again, I thought the cone was going to be bigger than what I thought it was. That's what she said. <laughs> uh, but, but yeah, so, you know what, before it melts, let me just eat this real quick. Almost finishing down with my cone. One thing I do want to say is... I like ice cream for sure. <laughs> Who doesn't like ice cream? <laughs> um, but sometimes if there's a lot of ice cream, I get tired of it or, you know, just get bored of it, of the sweet. But I haven't gotten tired of it, you know, and I'm about to finish it. Uh, I got the mix of the strawberry and strawberry and the chocolate. Uh, the um, cookies and cream didn't have a big scoop in it, but, you know, I did devour that part. And there you go, last bite, guys. It's gonna take it's gonna get me high as fuck, I hope. Going to our last flavor of the day. Um, and it is the mango sherbet or sherbet. Sherbet, sherbet. You already know what it is, man. Well, you guys know what I'm talking about. It's mango. Um, there is non dairy. So for all my smokers out there who, you know, ain't dairy friendly, you know, the boy Jason hooked you guys up with this one. And it's the mango sorbet. I'm just going to call it sorbet, you know, not short sorbet or short sorbet or sorbet, sorbet. You guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah, so let's get to it. Let's open this baby up. Hopefully it's like, some, you know, like see how it looks. Okay, okay, okay. So, you know, that's how it looks. It's pretty good, right? It looks pretty good, you know. It's been out. <clears throat> it should be a little more froze, you know, it should be in the freezer a little more. But it's been out for a little bit. Understandable. It's a little sour and sweet, you can say. Just because, you know, it's it's mango. You know, I had to pull out with the tahin, guys. You know, I had to pull out with the tahin. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, you can see. I have my tahin in there. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, okay. Okay, we're going somewhere, boys. I'll be eating it this way. This is the can of vibe way, guys. This is the can of vibe way. It's like you're just... The mango... Just melts in your mouth. And then you have the tahine. <laughs> Probably not a good way. Maybe if it's a mixed. Probably. Probably if, it mix, if it's like in a cup and it's mixed maybe very well. But I think we're going somewhere with, the, with these two combinations. I'm telling you guys. Right now, it's currently 12.14. But give myself an hour. And I'm going to see how it goes. How I'm feeling with just the ice cream itself. Of course, I took a dab, but I'm a high tolerance guy, so you guys, so the dab was just pre-game, you know, just because I'm super excited. And yeah, so I'm going to let this ice cream do its thing. Um, and yeah, so we'll see you guys in a bit. All right, y'all, so it's already 1.19, so I just kind of let the ice cream do its thing. I'm ready to munch and crunch. Uh, especially since it's already around lunchtime, I haven't ate lunch, so yeah, I just I just been waiting for this to to happen. Uh, so I feel very good overall uh, on this ice cream, especially uh, one because it is ice cream, and two, you know, it, it, what a what an amazing way to get high, literally. You know, uh, we got a cone, we added some tahini, you know, like. Various different ways, you know, to eat ice cream. Overall, like the taste, I, I give it a ten out of ten. You know, although the, the my least favorite was the peanut butter fudge, but like the the cookies and cream, the strawberry cream, the mango the sorbet or whatever you call that one, um, the just amazing flavors. Like nothing like weed taste at all. Everything was spot on, spot on. That was news on the episode that he just popped out on Can of Vibe not too long ago. And you know what? Just, just enjoy your ice cream and listen to the podcast episode. The effects, I give it a 9 out of 10. Um, I feel very uplifted and happy. Uh, maybe because, you know, it's ice cream. <laughs> you know, and it's just, it's just not your ordinary edible, you feel me? So that's pretty unique. And, and again, I just... You know, shout out to the boy, Jason. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's review. And we won't probably just see you guys in the next podcast episode or vlog. Take it easy.